I love playing rugby on a Saturday and just having the challenge of playing other teams. My favourite moment uh, of rugby at RGS was definitely winning the Murders Cup in 2013. I've also worked my way through the Worcester Chatter um, and I've been lucky enough to play for my country. My first taste of senior school rugby was at the Modus Cup when I was at the Grange and ever since then I've had a dream to play at Six Ways Under the Lights. At RGS we like to play a really quick, high tempo game of rugby. It's very skillful, fun to play, really exciting to watch. Through our innovative rugby player development programme we aim to develop boys uh, all the way from year 7 to 6th form uh, with a variety of aspects looking at rugby skills, uh, individual skills, strength and conditioning as well as fitness. In conjunction with that we're balancing their academic time uh, so that we get the best of them in the classroom and on the rugby pitch. My first love has always been playing rugby but uh, academics has to come first here and the school's been incredibly supportive in helping me balance both my sporting endeavours and my academics as well. RGS we have a mixture of coaches, both teachers and more importantly professional coaches and professional players. Uh, since I've been at Grammar I've had some coaching, personal coaching from Sean Perry, ex-England international and worked on kicking and passing. I thought my skills have come on a lot and it's nice to know what he's experienced playing at Twickenham and places like that. Having coaches such as John Clark, Marco Mama, Craig Gillies and Sean Perry come in means that we can offer really high level coaching to individual positions. We offer half-back clinics, back row clinics, line-out options, scrum clinics all with the latest Premiership thoughts and coaching techniques. Uh, our brand of rugby promotes being resolute, gracious and selfless uh, throughout all aspects of uh, the people's schooling. Our rugby development programme from Mini to Modus means that no matter whether you've been at RGS from day one or you're new to the school in any year, there is a clear pathway for you to get the most out of your rugby experience. Since year seven, uh, the rugby development programme has developed me into the program. I've been at the Grange since I was two years old and I've loved playing rugby all through the years and I've loved it even more now I've gone to the grammar. Our GS facilities are fantastic for rugby. We have the flag bedding that you can see behind me which has just had new drainage put in which means our facilities are always in top condition regardless of the weather. As well as your usual on-field rugby training we offer additional skill sessions in our sports halls, strength and conditioning sessions in our fitness centres and use all the school's facilities to offer a variety of coaching techniques and practices throughout the week. Here at RGS we always try and develop the boys in as many ways as possible, whether it be physically, academically or just expanding their horizons, taking them touring. We've been on recent tours to South Africa, South America and in the past also done New Zealand and the Cook Islands. Playing in South Africa um, was an incredible experience and it's been the perfect preparation for uh, playing rugby uh, here back in England. The physicality we picked up there was uh, transferable here and it's really helped in the season. So within school we look to develop our links with the Worcester Warriors which have been growing this year. Uh, quite a few of our boys are in their academy setup as well as playing for them uh, recreationally at a club level. As well as the county setup we have some of our coaches work as county selectors uh, and run the county under 16 team. Outside of the rugby sector we work with the university to develop our strength and conditioning using their facilities. Ultimately the success of our rugby development programme is shown by the players that we've produced. Johnny R currently playing at Worcester Warriors, Johnny Hughes has just left Worcester Warriors and moved to Loughborough and we've still got Josh Knott representing England 18 and Worcester Warriors weekly. Uh, I'm, I'm not sure where my rugby is going to take me um, but I'll always be grateful for the uh, Grammar family. So for me personally, rugby is not just a game, it's also about character development and making sure that we develop the best and brightest young people in the country.